All right. They saved the high energy vatos for the last. This guy is a que loco favorite, one of one of my favorites, and he emails me every other week to tell me that. <laughs> Welcome to the stage, Ernie G. Ernie G. <laughs> Let me hear you scream! Come on, clap with me, y'all. Come on, clap. And if you really, really came to party, then let me hear everybody say we came to party. Say we came to party. Say we came to party. We came to party. Say I'm proud to be gay. <laughs> singing, dog. I just wanted to include you somehow, bro. Hey, come on, bro. If you're getting proud, say it loud, brother. Say it. That's not your girlfriend. That's your cousin, fool. Don't lie, bro. Don't lie, bro. Don't lie, bro. You know you took her to prom, bro. Don't lie, bro. If you're getting proud, say it loud, bro. It's a new millennium. We can all get along. Come on, ride the train. Come on, Come on. I didn't mean to exclude you, bro. I'm sorry. Come on, ride the train. Come ride it. Come on, ride the train. It's a choo-choo train. Dog. I just messed it, dog. I just messed it, You know what I'm saying, bro? I was on Que a couple weeks ago, and I talked about how hoochies act when you're at a club, and you ask them to dance, and they're like, loser. <laughs> loser plus loser equals whatever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? They get all creative. Bro, I got emails from women all over the country teaching me their little whatever song and stuff, bro. Whatever made you loser. Whatever stupid moron. <laughs> Bro, I got sent a videotape of a high school cheerleading squad doing a hoochie cheer for me, bro. A hoochie cheer. I went, loser, loser, what a moron. Oh my God, whatever. As if, as if. Talk to the hand, read my palm, kiss my butt, and poop be gone. Bro. They're teaching hoochie in high school, bro! What is up with that? I don't understand this. Women, do me a favor. If you want to hook up with a man, just be up front with us. Just be honest with us, man. Just tell us from the get-go what your story is, you know? Let us know if you're married. We're not jealous. Let us know if you have any kids, you know? Let us know if you have a warrant, whatever it is. I'm serious, that happened to me, bro. That ha I was at this club, right, and I saw this fine girl. So I said, so what's up, girl? How you doing? <laughs> right away, she starts in with an attitude. Um, anyways. <laughs> so what do you do? I said, well, I'm the comedian. I'm about to go perform right now. Typical hoochie response. Nah, I shut up, don't lie. <laughs> what? I'm the comedian. I'm going to go perform right now. Stupid. Nah, I shut up, don't lie. <laughs> I said, whatever, girl, I'll talk to you later, right? So I go perform, I do my show. Now she wants to talk to me, right? Now I qualify. But she was fine, dog, so it was on. So I said, so what's up, girl? You wanna hook up after the show? You wanna get together on Monday? What do you wanna do? She said, look, I'm not gonna lie to you, right? I have to turn myself in on Monday. I'm like, turn yourself into what? A pumpkin Cinderella? She said, no, I have to turn myself into county jail. I'm like, what? Well, tell me that now. Tell me that from the get-go, because I don't want to get all attached to you. And like, the next time I see you, it'll be behind a three-inch glass window going, put your hand right here. I don't know, bro. And she called me Collect from her cell, bro. She called me Collect, and I said, hello? And she goes, hi, it's Sonia. I said, mommy? She said, hi, puppy. I said, puppy, it's you. I said, aren't you in jail? She said, yeah. I just didn't want you to think I was neglecting you. 
I said, neglect me, don't collect me. <laughs> she said, she said, don't be like that. I'm gonna get out like in five days. I told her, nah, shut up, don't lie. <laughs> Listen, listen. You guys are always worried what the keto successful relationship is. Listen up, Ernie G's about to drop some knowledge. A woman will do anything for you, bro, as long as you're giving her one thing. She doesn't want you to be sensitive. Talk to me. Reveal your feelings to me. Be my friend. Fuck, forget that, bro. A woman will do anything for you as long as you're giving her the big bam, bam. You know the big fan fan, bro? The big fan fan? And I'm not talking about any kind of fan fan. Anybody can throw a fan 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 I'm talking about the kind of fan fan where your ass is tight and your legs are shaking and you're looking at her and she's saying things she's never said before and she's reaching for things that aren't even there. And you look at her dead in the eyes and you say, BAM! BAM! You felt that hot, girl. You felt that hot. But then again, then again, bro. Then again, bro. Doesn't always work, dog. Because just the other day I was throwing the big pam pam with my ruka, right? And I was like, am I the man, baby? Am I your Aztec warrior? Did I rock your world? And she just looked at me and went, whatever! My name's Ernie G, you guys, I'm out of here, see ya!